Alright, so um, this video I'm just going to demonstrate the uh, disconnect issue that I'm having since my 2.2 uh, kilowatt spindle upgrade on my Shapoko. So you can see uh, I have carbide motion open here. I have my uh, machine off right now. I'll turn it on. So then I'll connect to the cutter and it connects fine. We'll initialize it. So it all initializes fine. Good to go. Um, no problems. I can even um, jog it. Rapid position. And then uh, just do a quick uh, air print air car or whatever I guess is what they call it um, just to just a quick one so I'll just uh, start this one So that all goes well. Then what happens is I'll load up another file here just to show you. Start this job. So this is all well and good long as the spindle is off so if I hit run try to get the screen in at the same time as soon as I hit run my spindle turns on and then carbide motion disconnects so try to connect again get unknown serial port number error can't connect no matter what I do even if I turn it off turn it back on clear these errors out of the way try and connect again still won't connect so then I turn the spindle off and I connect oh it won't have to turn it off turn it back on clear the error Thinks the spindle's on for some reason. Then it connects. Then I can initialize and everything again. But again, in the middle of this, turn on the spindle again.
There it goes. It took a couple seconds that time, but uh, well, it doesn't seem to do any good no matter what I do. You can see this green wire. I don't have this install finalized, but uh, this green wire is a is a uh, direct ground and um, I have it um, connected directly to the right to the board just to make sure that it is positively getting grounded properly it most certainly is I believe this is the revision number right there so according to what I read this must be the latest board I don't know but I haven't been able to do any work on this thing yet I got uh, the new HDZ axis upgrade and I'm really anxious to get this thing going I wish it would work uh, anyway um, let me know what I can do to get this working right. Thanks for watching. Take care.